The next question says two identical prisms 1 and 2 each with angle 30 degree, 60 degree and 90 degree are placed in contact as shown in figure. A ray of light passes through the combination in the position of minimum deviation and suffers a deviation of 30 degree. If the prism 2 is removed, then the angle of deviation of the same ray is. Now the diagram given in the question is something like this. This is 30. This is 30. Those are 90 and these are 60. Now the ray of light comes like this goes horizontal and bends like this so now here i can say that this is the reason why it causes the minimum deviation for which i can say i is equal to e and that is equal to a plus delta m by 2 now if you consider this as one single prism the angle of prism becomes 60 degree so if we substitute that, this is 60, the deviation is 30 by 2, we get I is equal to E as 45 degree. Now if you remove this prism, so the diagram would just become like this. Now we need to understand that the angle of incidence will remain the same, but the angle of emergence will not. I can say in this case, E becomes equal to 0. I remains the same as 45. So this time I need to use I plus E is equal to A plus delta. Now since E is 0, I is 45, it is 45 plus 0 and this time the angle of prism A is only 30 degree since the second prism is removed. And so the deviation found is 45 minus 30. 15 degree which is your final answer